Hello everyone, this is Dr. Collector One here with another, well not another, I mean another video for today. Uh, today I'll just be showing off my drawings that I've drawn within the past years. Uh, so let's get right into it. So I'll, I'll start with the most recent ones first. So this one I had it on eBay, no one's bid on it yet. But I lowered the starting bid at like $20 on my eBay. Um, I did this mainly just for fun. Um, and yeah, and one of my friends brought it, like a really cool idea about it, like how, like even though we're in the tough times, you could still like be up, I guess, I don't know. Um, and another one is the Venom drawing. You guys probably seen me, the video of me drawing this and coloring it in. Uh, I was gonna put it up for auction, but I decided not to because I thought I did really good on it. And look at the city. I thought the city looked really cool, especially with the color scheme with Venom too. Uh, but I'll eventually do a drawing with Venom and Carnage. Um, so this one's really personal for me, but like if you know me, I'm and you're one of my friends, uh, I went through a really tough time. Uh, like in junior year, I went, no, sophomore year. I went through a really tough time. I lost my uncle, uh, went through a tough breakup and I lost like two other family members. But the worst part was my uncle because um, he uh, had one, one year old at the time that, um, they had this guy right here, uh, and then when he passed away, he, has, he had twins on the way. So I thought it drew something really special for my family. Um, it, this is like kind of like the moment that he never had type of deal. He wasn't able to hold all three of his children in one sitting. He never even got to uh, hold these two when they, they were born. So this one's really special for me and my family. Um, this one, I drew not too long ago, obviously. I, I, I mean, pictures, I crop these out, but um, this is supposed to be, it's supposed to go on with that. I mean, AP portfolio. Um, we're supposed to have like 10 drawings uh, for a sustained investigation. My sustained investigation is like, how do pe people feel through a loss? So this is supposed to be like my uncle watching over his three kids. As you can see, I'm holding, holding on to them. But yeah, there's that one. And this was like a concept art for me. So same deal, same uh, concept and stuff going on. But uh, this was originally supposed to be like all actual person. But I'm like, I made, when I made a new one, which I'll show you next. I thought I could turn this guy into a ghost, uh, resembling like my uncle checking up on his family members and those that are troubled. And uh, this is supposed to be like me. So I was really a huge Spider-Man fan during that time. This kind of lyric went well with me. It was uh, the Spider-Man to the Spider-Verse album with, uh, what's his name? I think it's Blue Prince. Or something like that and the song is let go uh, sometimes I just want to let go look look up look up to the sky and hope you rest in peace that's the kid in the like dark bubble light trying to get in all the pictures memories and stuff of this person but uh, originally I did not put the wood floor in so I just added that in to make it have more depth and yeah that's all I've got for this drawing I'll show you the finished one Nice. This one I thought really was better, but so going off that same thing, it's the same thing going on in here, but instead it's like a hole too with the bubble because the wood is like coming up, breaking. Um, and I added a shadow because in that one, it doesn't have a shadow because it's really a ghost. Um, and I added a few more things in the background and the window. It's supposed to, the windows were supposed to mean like windows of opportunity, kind of. You could choose any one, like a dark one, um, any others, um, add the city in there. But yeah, and I like how it's like looks really like 
everywhere on the floor, but I thought I did really good on that one. Um, so this one was after I just went through like a tough breakup, but it's supposed to be like a hand and then all this, and then a ghost hand, like missing the one they usually love and always wear with. But yeah, I'm not gonna go into details on that one. Um, also, same deal with the sustained investigation. This is supposed to be on my uncle in the doorway, but, and then his son just waiting for him at work. Um, but he's really a ghost or like he imagines him coming in from work. Uh, sometimes my cousin usually points at the door and it says daddy calls out for dad waiting from work. He usually does that before he passed away and he still, sometimes he does it still. But yeah, I thought that one was really good. Um, this one was same deal, same investigation. This is supposed to be me holding the picture of me and my uncle. I meant a picture of me and my uncle at Disney World. I liked how I added the details in the background to make it look like it's like fantasize, fantasy kind of. But there's me, my uncle. Yeah, that was a fun day with me and him. Um, same investigation. This was supposed to be like the feelings that I was going through um, with all those troubles that I was going through. So I made like the colors kind of look like, I don't know, chaotic kind of fun, like a fake smiling face, like a mask, because like when I'm out in public, I would ask, I'd act like I'm happy, but really like upset, angry. Um, one of my friends, when I was drawing it, he, I was drawing it and he accidentally slipped and made me round it, but he, he thinks that it has character, so it's not a huge deal. This one, so I also did just pick these up from school today um, because of the coronavirus thing, they were stuck in there, but for some reason this one was like fell, so it was like folded over while everything else was holding it down. But this was supposed to be me. So after all those problems that I went through, I did a lot of punching, the punching bag and stuff. So my uncle passed away with cancer, obviously. He's you're the reason why I for a loss. Um, so uh, this was this part right here with the beach. He was married on the beach. I, I was there with, with him. Um, I was a chauffeur. There's a wedding cake, ocean. Um, and then the fireworks, we would, um, before he passed away, we would celebrate 4th of July with him every year. But after he passed away, we kind of like stopped doing it. Um, and then during the same time, we would usually go bowling. He's a really good bowler. That's why I have strike. Yeah, and that, in each one of these areas, I had a blood because spewing out, it's supposed to, I mean, like, like red, blood red, blood red color coming out of like the punching bag that has cancer symbol on it. It's supposed to resemble like his blood on the cancer's hands kinda. So yeah, there's that. And then this one I thought was really cool. So this one is supposed to be like a adventures with father and son. This is the 1972 Corvette. My grandpa has that in his garage. Um, this is supposed to be them driving around. Uh, everyone may class like the clouds, like fantasy kind of. I made the tree look like it's hands, make it look a little more fun. Mountain, fields, yeah. I really like this one a lot. Um, this one needs a little more work, obviously, but I added a cardinal to make it resemble like reincarnation of him watching over us because after he passed away, we would see cardinals a lot of the times gravestone him coming down from heaven um and then the dark air is like him it, like you're in a dark place but then when you're there you kind of like see him i guess and as you can see he doesn't have a shadow whereas this person does so there's that one this i drew in my sophomore year it's supposed to be a self-portrait of me i mean i was in that was like two years, three years ago. I realized that the eye looks a little bigger. And as you can see, my like this side is a little more swollen than that side. It's because I've been nailed in this eye a lot more than um, this side because I play baseball. 
and back then I had a hard time seeing. That's why I'm wearing contacts a lot now. I'm doing vision training and stuff. Um, this one, I was a freshman and I was really excited for the Logan movie. So I drew that. It took me forever to do. It took a lot of time. Same deal with this one ring over here. Logan hand with the claws coming out. Obviously my mom framed it um, while well, it was not finished, but I think it looks pretty good still. But yeah, that's all I've got for my drawings to show you for right now. That's all the ones that I have on hand right now, but that's all I've got. So like I said already, I already did the photos of the day. Make sure you check out my buddy's Instagram page, photography, at Highline Photos. Uh, also my two best friends that I usually call do, play Call of Duty with. Uh, Connor's car page is LadJeep07. Christian's car page is BadView767. Make sure you check them out. My PayPal's in the description if you could donate. Um, I need to get better camera equipment. I'm just using my phone and a tripod to hold it. Um, and I need to get more games to react to because all the games that I'm reacting to right now, they're old. I mean, not extremely old. I like playing Spider-Man and Resident Evil still. And even though I haven't played Claire yet, I mean, it'd be pretty cool to get a new game to play, especially when it's more relevant. Um, so if you could donate, that would be awesome. And then to give back to you guys, I'm planning, if I get enough money and subscribers for this, I will do my own merchandise. I will give the first 100 subscribers a free hoodie. And it will be high quality, not cheap. And to increase the chances of me being able to do that, if you could share this with others and then donate to me, that'd be awesome. Um, but besides that, that's all I've got for this video. So thank you and like and subscribe.